were moments away from investigating a Stillwater volunteer company. Bill Hughes reached out to us through our website and we're absolutely excited to be here tonight. Did you hear that? I swear to God, it was like something like shuffled behind me. Try to take two, I guess, huh? We're moments away from our investigation. I'm sitting here in a fire truck, something that I've always wanted to do. Bill Hughes reached out to us and found us on the web, and uh, we're absolutely excited to be here in beautiful Stillwater, New Jersey. Um, many of the people here believe that most of the claims of objects being thrown, uh, some EVPs, walking, and footsteps are some of the members that have strong ties here uh, who put a lot of uh, sweat and time into building this beautiful place. We're um, we're absolutely ready to go this evening, and uh, we're going to try a couple different tactics. I swear to God, it's like it's, I keep hearing crap behind me. Let's just end it. Let's roll. Let's right. get settled down. Let's. Uh, you guys got radio? You got radio? I got it. You got it. Jake's got radio. I got it. Cool. All right. Go spread out. Go get comfortable. Yeah, you got the EVP in the rear, so have fun with that. <laughs> <laughs> have fun with that. There's a, a, a residual ghost uh, fire truck down there. Whoa. I'm like right here. I <laughs> know you're right there. I'm coming for you, ghost. Yeah, they work this close. Yeah. If there's anyone down here with us, I just want to introduce ourselves. Uh, my name is Mike. I'm here with Chris, Brian, and Emily. Uh, we are here just to capture your presence and let it be known that you are here. If you have a message as well, we are here to try to capture that message and get it out for you. If someone's down here, uh, there's this red dot to my left. You can come up and talk into it. once work here? Did anyone die here? What is, is that them, Chris? I, I hear chattering, yeah. Yeah, I need to. I Did thought you? it was really clean it was on the, here. Do you mind that we're here? Or would you like us to leave? Heard that? It sounds like he's screaming though. That's not, yeah, that did sound like yeah. It's just like travels, man. But why would it? Is it him? Are you sure it was him? I didn't hear that one. No, I'm asking Chris. I can't be sure, but it sounded like he was. I hear him. Emily's moving around. Yeah. Emily's walking away. Emily, stop moving. Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Well, what the f was that? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was Brian. Oh my god, what did he do? Did he just scream? Yeah. Well, that sounded like a girl. <laughs> what did you touch? <laughs> did you touch me? I didn't touch anything. 
Oh my god, he screamed like a little girl there. <laughs> that scared me. Oh my god. I thought someone said hello. <laughs> oh god, chills. Ugh. Right. That scared me. Obviously, with the little girls screaming. <laughs> <laughs> it is really loud. Yeah, it's really loud down here too. It's hilarious. I was so scared that I couldn't react. And it was so loud. Oh my god. What about me? The best part was you guys go, shh, quiet. <laughs> <laughs> the boom! Oh that thing was right behind me. Oh my god. I've never been so startled in my life. I, just, I froze. Holy I couldn't move. Crap. <laughs> Christopher. I gotta do that every once in a while. Hold on, yeah. Because I was leaning up against this thing, and I thought maybe I turned one of the generators on. I thought on it was one of the generators. Yeah. just gonna pop on. Oh my god. <laughs> us a favor and come closer to us. Make some type of contact. You can touch us, speak to us. That's exactly what I heard. And then that's when they were your radio voice and they said the same thing. Where does Kyle go? I thought it came from like a uh. I thought it came from that socket, there's no one out there. Kind of like a yell, but like, like a uh. Exactly, that's exactly what I heard. Uh, did you hear the bang right before you started turning the camera? Yeah. <laughs> oh, how long have I been in the summer? Alright, Sarah, number two, you ready to go? Oh my god. What the f is that? Oh my god. That was Brian. Oh my god, what did he do? Did he just scream? Yeah. That sounded like a girl. <laughs> did you hear that? No. I heard that. Yep. It's all the way closed, isn't it? That was just right here, behind me. Okay, that's fucking walking. Fred, is that you? Come on, Fred, move something. Drop that boot. Joe, can you can you walk towards us, please? But like I said before, we don't want to jump to conclusions. It could be the wind. Right. So, Fred Ritter, are you still here?
is still as hell. I feel like it reacts more to Fred. Don't you think? Then we have to go outside and see if it's windy at some point. Mm -hmm. We will. Oh, I heard a, I heard a click. What? Is that them walking? What the f**k was that? Oh my god! What the f**k <laughs> was that? Oh my brain! <laughs> stop! Stop! What the f**k? <laughs> Is that above us? Dude. Is it windy now? No, it can't be. Wait, what? Tell them to look outside. Did you just hear that shit? <laughs> We are sitting, and it was loud as balls. <laughs> Is it? Tell me to look outside. Is it windy? Can you tell if it's windy outside? <laughs> well, that's what we're wondering. But we're trying to figure out if they got really windy out. That, that was crazy. that was loud. Wow. That was crazy. He said it's dead still outside. <laughs> okay. Okay, so, okay, so just get, get your shit together. Oh my god, I got really... <laughs> Jeez, Jeez, you're about to get the hell out of there, were you? It was like the phone's running at me. <laughs> that was loud. Fred, please do that again. Jace, explain what we just heard. Well, we, we've been trying to make contact with Fred and Frank, and I've been messing it up, and Jake brought the point that we getting a lot more reactions with <clears throat> using Fred and uh, I mean we've heard a couple noises and kind of thought maybe we could attribute that to the wind but it's it's dead quiet out there and uh... that was creepy so what were you thinking uh, I got that same feeling as Jason did like I got like that whole, like that heavy like holy crap it's coming after us but it actually it, it almost felt I know it's kind of weird to say, but it almost felt like there was an energy that moved with it. Fred, are you still here with us? We're here to be friendly tonight. You know, we just want to talk with you, we want to communicate, see if you're still around. A lot of the members are hearing things. They're seeing wine glasses being moved and thrown to the floor. They're kind of wondering what's going on. That's why we're here. So now's your chance to talk to us. Let us know that someone's here. Or let us know why you're here. It's Joe. It could be Joe Vanderhagen. <laughs> Joe, did you build this place all by yourself? We know you're here. Just show us that you're here. Make a noise. Walk towards us again. I got to urinate. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Go pee. Because I got to fast forward to it. Can't. <laughs> oh, you can't urinate? It's <laughs> like, <laughs> Dude, I, I don't. I just, I don't know. Jace, is it class A? Because <laughs> it's not class A, I'm not listening to it. I only do class A. I do nah, sure. I don't want to listen to them. <laughs> Never mind. You got things to do. I can't listen to team minus. <laughs> so what exactly am I hearing? So just, you'll just listen. Just yeah, just I'll get it to the you'll, point. You'll, this, you'll, is, this, you'll, was, this is when you three were upstairs? Yes. yes. What do you think? So we had to go outside and see if it's windy at some point. Because mm -hmm. it oh, I heard it. I heard a click. What? Is that them walking? What the f 
Yeah. Wait, you were you were all sitting still? Sitting yeah, still. It's dead still. Dead still. That's the same reaction. So the <laughs> that's that what was all, coming that, towards that's us. That's what we thought was coming towards us. And that was from over here. It was. It, it was in this space here. Space above us. <laughs> wow, it's pretty incredible. Oh wow! You right? Can you go one more time? Yeah, yes. I'll do it one yeah. more time. Yes. But they said there was a catwalk when they were building. Oh, I thought you meant like. Wow. Uh, um, that was loud. Like here. that's not house. It was. It right. started. It started over here, and it just came loud and loud right towards us. Like that's that. That's. That's what startled us. No owls or anything. As that's almost as if something was like. Crawling. Jake. Jake said it right. Where it felt like a, a truck going by you, and you feel that breeze. So now, now think You're about think about what we just said, and listen to it again now. So realize that they're not moving at all. And it's yeah, aware of their surroundings. All three of your seats. <coughs> like, like, we were legitimately scared. Like, we were like, what the f is this? It sounds guys. like the whole house is shaking. Yeah, that's what it, it felt like. You have to <laughs> delete that. Yeah. What the? What was I that? think you only. <laughs> it's like you guys, like, let's try to make this job more difficult. It's sorry. It's rated R. I heard a very quick. What? Is that the walking? What the f <laughs> It's as if you... <laughs> it's hard to... Did you guys hear anything like that when you were here? <laughs> no. No, nothing. It's as if you let a little kid, like, just run across the... Yeah. It was like that sort it's of... Like, yeah. 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 yeah, but like... Yes. Like, yes. Yeah. Yes. And like the, the, the creaking was so loud. It was. It, was it really sounded loud. like the house was moving. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. Like that's what, and then we were like, what the? F There's no moose. <laughs> 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 we're like, what the fudge? There's no. The wind. The wind wasn't active. And that's when we asked. We we, we radioed. Down that's the common sense windy. answer. Is the wind. Right. I just said that if I'm I'm looking at it something from when they were building this place like something crazy. And it just keeps replaying itself over and over again. I mean, there's no way of recreating that. There's, and I can see there's just no would way. Want to run out of here. Yeah, to hear that. <laughs> if I'm going to give a natural experience, a natural uh, explanation, it would be something on the roof. Yeah, that would be the only thing. That and now, did you see how steep raccoon. that roof is? It's a pitch. <laughs> it's it's a pitch. Unless. A raccoon, you know. Unless a tree branch falls off the roof. Yeah, like sliding off of yeah. the. That would be the only thing I could think of. I think it's going to be more something on the roof. Brian, door. Brian, do you want to tell the camera yeah. what we're doing right now? Yeah, a little right meltdown. Brian, right. tell them what we're doing right now. Brian, do you have a turtleneck on? <laughs> no. There's a point where it's quiet and you still can hear it. While the entire team huddles together to review potential audio evidence, the door to the building slowly swings open. Since the opening of the main door was one of the unexplainable events reported by members of the fire company, a static IR camera was trained on the door throughout the night's investigation. This strange occurrence was not only captured by the IR camera, but was also witnessed live on one of the monitors set up at the equipment center. Also unexplainable is that minutes before and after the door's opening, the motion sensor above the door turned from red to green, indicating movement. Does this strange event have a natural explanation, or is it proof that there is some truth to the ghostly stories that are shared by the men and women of the Stillwater Volunteer Fire Company? We're all sitting in the tool shed here, and um, I started hearing the creaking of the door open up at the same time Sarah was watching the, uh, the DVR, and watching the door open up, so Jake was the last person in and out, so he claims that uh, he didn't shut it all the way. Now, Jake, did it, do you remember it clicking? It was like that. Like this. Yeah. It's just, there's actually some pool with it going in. I mean, how far did it How open far did up? it open? It's pretty far. Cool. You like that? Like yeah. this? Let me look further? at the camera. I'll be able to type in the camera. Hold on, do it again. Now right. Right there? Yeah. Because listen, it doesn't even... That's where it stops. I heard this. Yeah, right. So right... It opened... So it opened that far. Oh, shit. Did you just hear that? Did you hear that? A girl? Yeah. I feel like we need to look around. Yeah. Is the wind blowing? No. No. Do you hear walking? Frank, is that you? Hey, that's yeah. 
Is there a fire? There you go. As the team uses the sound of sirens as a potential triggering mechanism, the audio on Brian's video camera captures this unexplainable audio anomaly. Jason, who is filming at the exact same moment, doesn't capture the strange sound on his video device. Adding to the mystery is that earlier in the investigation, an eerily similar sound is captured in the loft. Is this creepy female-sounding audio anomaly the same spirit of a woman captured throughout the night's investigation? I thought that was real. Oh wow, I was like, hang on.
does your grandson still volunteer here? Whatever spirits are here, please know that you can use this device to speak to us. We can hear you through this, so please speak to us. Is there a woman here? Or an Indian. Ninkachkina. Oh my Did I move? I might have moved the chair. I just want you to know that a girl didn't say anything if I listened to this later. It's during this Team Spirit Box session that Chris's digital recorder captures a strange audio anomaly beneath the white noise generated by the device. Hearing it live at the time, Chris questions Sarah and Emily if either said anything, and both answer no. Is this captured EVP the spirit of a woman trying to take part in the banter caused by Jason's joke? Is there a woman here? Can you be very loud for us again? Jason? All right, good. Thank you. Keep can going. you do it again for me, loudly? We can hear you. You need to let us know you're there! If you're downstairs, this is your last chance! You have to let us know you're here! I know we've tried this before, but I'm going to make two knocks. After I'm done, you can make two knocks after my done. <laughs> 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 yeah. uh, it's, it's, it's after my knocking. It is at that point where there will be two more knocks. Those will be yours. After. Fine. Knocks. Fred, you need to be loud for your company here. Do it for the boys who work here. Well, thus concludes another exhausting evening. Um, I, I think we really tried every avenue tonight. Um, especially with the members. Some interesting occurrences early in the night. Definitely need to go back and check that footage. Uh, you know, we're going to head back downstairs and start packing up and uh, back home. But I think another successful night. I want to thank 
Bill for having us out here in the Stillwater Volunteer Fire Department. You have a great place. Uh, a little chilly tonight, but uh, we love being out here. Thank you very much. <laughs> it was the thank you very much at the end. <laughs> you're like you're receiving an award. I just, just talking. Uh huh. I'm just talking. Man. You're just talking. Yeah. You can cut that out. <laughs> <laughs>